DIY Range Hood Part 2. And if you missed my first video, go check it out to see how we built this frame using a custom kit. After we assembled the frame, we inserted the exhaust fan and hooked everything up. Then it was time to drywall. The drywall will serve as a base for our Venetian plaster, which will give it that very European feel that I'm going for. In order to make the drywall bendable, we scored it so that it could go on the front slope and on the corbels. I covered all the seams and holes with drywall tape and joint compound. I used corner beads to create a rounded edge finish. I tried to staple them at first, totally didn't work, so I used the spray adhesive, which is pink. For more details and everything that I use, go check out my channel. You can find it under my profile. In part three, I'm gonna show you how we apply the Venetian finish to give it a stone look. Look. 